taxonomies. Let's keep going. Let's keep building. All right, next up, let us hook up these URLs here, right? So we have the, you can see blog slash tag slash placeholder, blog slash tag slash pun. We're going to want to see all of the entries that have been tagged that have that taxonomy term associated with them. So let's hook up some templates and show you how that works. Let's jump over to our code editor and talk about convention. All right, so in order to have a template that shows a taxonomy's terms and its entries, you're going to match the folder name of that taxonomy. All right, so we're going to create a folder here called tags because that's our taxonomy name. And then inside that, we're going to create an index.antlers, if I could type, antlers.html. .html and a show.antlers.html. Next, let's grab a little bit of markup here. Boom, boom, rip all this stuff out. Uh, actually, let's leave this. We'll take the pagination out. Uh, we'll leave this. And instead of collection colon blog, we're just going to put entries. Okay, that's it. And th this is the show template. So what's going to happen is it's going to pull the title of the taxonomy. It's going to grab all of the entries that have been tagged that have then been associated with that term. And, um, and then it's going to loop through them and pull in that card. All right, so everything worked. We can visit one of these URLs and we should see all of the entries tagged with pun, which is true. This one is also tagged with pun. And if this one would show all them tagged with placeholder, and that's these four, and uh, everything is wired up. I mean, that's, that's as simple as it can possibly get. Now let's create a page that shows all of the tags so our users can choose to browse by tag. All right, so this is gonna be the URL route. There's nothing here. This is the empty template that we just created. This is the index page. If I come in here, paste a little HTML, replace, uh, yeah, tags is fine. We're gonna grab two, get rid of two of these lines, loop through the tags, hook up the URL, Hook up the title, refresh, and you're going to see placeholder, fishing, beach, and pun. Now, all of these uh, tags are scoped inside of the blog collection. So, if you reuse the blog, the uh, the tags taxonomy with another collection, maybe you have a photo gallery or a team or news or press releases or whatever, you can reuse that taxonomy, assign it to multiple collections. And in this way, you will use this uh, template structure, this view uh, naming convention to have different templates that show those, um, the entries associated with them. Now, if you want to have a page that shows all of the tags across everything, just, cr just move it into the root. Okay. And it's going to look basically the same, except you're going to see uh, the URL will be slash tags, and then all of the URLs for each individual term are going to not include the blog, but this is going to work basically the same, except it will be cross collection. So in that case, you're going to want to use some conditionals like it to show the content differently if you need to. And that's basically it. In the next video, we'll get into customizing uh, taxonomies themselves with their own blueprint and their own custom fields.